Hello you lovely people, welcome back to my channel for volume 11 guys of Dream On. Yep, that demo disc on the front of the official Sega Dreamcast magazine back in the day. Yep, we're on to volume 11 guys. How good is this one going to be once we hook this beast up? Hmm, it's going to be interesting. As you all know guys, uh, I've been covering this for a while, well, 11 episodes, isn't it? Now, it's the 11th episode of a demo disc that was on the front of the official Dreamcast magazine back in the day where you get movies and you get some playable demos. And I tell you what, there's been some stunners. The best one, in my opinion at the moment, is the Christmas edition. But where are we going from here? What is going to be on this edition, guys? I'm sure it's going to be stellar. Because I've not been completely disappointed. There was one volume where I was a little bit... Hmm, could have been a bit better. But to be honest, when you got it on the front of your magazine... I mean, the magazine cost 4 99 or something like that. Or 4 94 or something. Uh, so just under, just just below a fiver, guys. And to get that on the front was just fantastic. Because there was magazines that didn't have anything on the front of them that were costing that anyway. So it was a doozy to have that disc. But yeah, shall we have a look, guys? Shall we plug this into the Dreamcast and have a look at what Volume 11 brought to us back in the day? And of course, if you've got them, you might want to dig them out and put them on again, guys. Because I tell you what, they might only be demos, but they're bloody fun to play. Especially if you haven't got them in your collection. Um, up to now, all of the demos, the playable demos that have been there, I've got. So... Let's see if I've got all these as well, guys. Right, back in a sec. He says, all oh, that bring back. Oh, I love doing these, guys. They're really, really fun. Now, also, guys, if you um, want to check out the other volumes, just go to my playlist, guys. I've now put a playlist up. It's just called the Sega Dreamcast Dream On. And uh, go in there, and you can see all the previous volumes that I've covered. Right, now, I really am going to be back in a sec. Right, here we go, guys, with a look at, yep, Dreamcast and Dream On and Volume 11, guys. Yeah, we're up to Volume 11. Um, yeah, it's that disc that was slapped on the front of your official Dreamcast magazine back in the day. Let's have a look at the background as usual first. Looks like, a yeah, the inside of a spaceship, guys, sort of like where the, uh, the docking bay is to me. Let me know what you think. Bit more linear than usual, not so much going on, but yeah, still pretty damn good. But the most important thing, guys, is what is on here. Now, I'm going to have a rolling demo kicking in a minute, a rolling movie, I should say. Let's see what one it is. So yeah, um, these are fantastic guys back in the day. They really did make your five quid nearly worth the money. Right, let's see which rolling movie kicks in. Oh, it's a Sega Sports one, so... Oh, there we go, Virtua Tennis, guys. That's what's kicking in. Brilliant. Because it does, it does, you know, alternate. It won't always be the same one. I love this game to bits, guys. Absolutely adore it. I've always said if, uh, if it's a good tennis game, then I really appreciate it because I love tennis games. But they have to be good ones. And this is a fantastic franchise, it really is. I think I've liked every single entry into the franchise. It's 
still looks bloody awesome to this day, it really does. Yeah, always the mini games, guys. The mini games make this a dream of a franchise. They're fantastic mini games. So you get a lot of a uh, movie this time around. Then. Yeah, brilliant. Back into the uh, menu, guys. Here we go. I tell you what, we're going to change it up a bit this time. Right, we're going to go through this first. So yeah, you get Wacky Races, playable, brilliant game, covered it on my channel before. You get Super Magnetic Neo, playable, fantastic platformer guys, again, covered it on my channel before. You get Toy Commander, playable, so that's the third appearance of Toy Commander. Obviously we had the Christmas edition as well. Then we have a fantastic game, guys. Oh my god, did I play this to death at the time. I know it's a dance game, but it's a fantastic one. It's Space Channel 5 Movie. NHL 2K Movie. Virtual Tennis, as we just saw. Movie. Marvel vs. Capcom 2 Movie. And then back round to Wacky Races. But as I was saying, guys, I want to change it up a bit this time. And we're going to have a look at another movie first. Oh my god, I love it this bloody game to death. Here we go guys, Space Channel 5. I'll let you read all the bits and bobs at the bottom again. Here we go, move it down. Pause is your best friend if you need longer. Here we go. Good old Eula. I must cover this game on my channel guys, a full, you know, standalone video because it is awesome. Oh, wow. What a fantastic movie that was. Oh, it just makes me want to grab it and play it right now. Fantastic. Back onto the menu, guys. Shall we do our first playable? Yeah, shall we go for Wacky Races first, guys? Here we go. Usual, it's all going to come up again, guys. Here we go. Once again, let you read that. And move on down. There we go. Right, here we go. Let's see if anything else kicks in. Oh, 
I say, I covered this on my channel before. Fantastic little racer, it really is. And now, here they are, the most daredevil group of daffy drivers to ever whirl their wheels in the wacky races, competing for the title of world's wackiest racer. The cars are approaching the starting line. First is the Turbo Terrific, driven by Peter Perfect. Next is Rufus Roughcut and Sawtooth in the Buzz Wagon. Maneuvering for position is the Army Surplus Special. Right behind is the Anthill Mob in their bulletproof bomb. Then there's ingenious inventor Pat Pending in his converter car. Oh, here's the lovely Penelope Pitstop. Next, we have the Boulder Mobile with the Slag Brothers Rock and Gravel. Lurching along is the Creepy Coop with the Gruesome Twosome, and right on their tail is the Red Max. And there's the Arkansas Chuckabug with Luke and Flubber Bear. Sneaking along last is that mean machine with those double-dealing do-batters, Dick Dastardly, and his sidekick, Muttley. <laughs> I love the way he laughs. Love it. Oh, I used to love Stop the Pigeon and Wacky Races. Oh, fantastic. Back in the day. All right, here we go then, guys. Let's press start. New game, absolutely. Right, so yeah, here we go, this is where you choose who you want to be. Not available in this demo. What a surprise. Penelope! Not available again. Oh, what a shame. Not available. Not available. And not available. <laughs> you don't get much of a choice really, guys, do you? No. Yeah, you literally get <laughs> two choices, but I think. Is it two choices, guys? Yeah, just the two. Penelope and this bloody lot here. Right, okay, let's go for them then. Yeah, okay then. Yeah, alright. Why bother on the demo, but never mind. I'll still put me flipping initials in. Yeah, there we go. That'll do. Thank you. Uh, cart. Yeah, definitely cart. Right, here we go. Let's have a look. Oy, little swine. No, oh, always. Yeah, there we go. For, oh, yeah, of course you're not allowed in there yet, are you? Uh, track challenge. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. Brilliant. Yeah, let's go here. Okay, smoky then. Ah, uh, that tat. Mm, blah, 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 blah. Oh, let's go for that. Mm, yeah, okay. Hmm. Okay, that'll do. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, because you've got to set them to each button. Right, here we go. Let's see what we can do with anything. No, just dropping something down. As I say, this is a fantastic card game. Fantastic. Again, once you get used to mapping the buttons for your... Uh, the uh, naughty stuff to throw at people and what have you. Looks like I've used it all up already, right? So there's a little bit more to it than uh, you would get in Mario Kart, for instance, where you just pick them up and shoot them. With this, you've got to map them, and then when you run out, you've got to obviously get, get them replaced. There we go, like that. Where are you, swine? Oh, hey. As you can see, guys, it is, it's fantastic. And the graphics are long, brilliant. Oh, 
There's no way on earth I'm going to win this one. Oh, stay into the bloody water. Look. Come on, back up. Here. Come on, back up. You yeah, bugger. That's it. Over there. Come on. Come on, come on, come on, you sod. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm definitely last now, guys. Well, what do you expect? And it's me. It's me. Final lap. Final lap to despair. <laughs> but yeah, oh my awful play once again guys, don't let that yeah, you know detract from this being an absolutely fantastic game guys. And I'm sure you play a lot better than me. What do you make of this one, the auction on the 66, eh, Mark? What do you make of this one? Do you like the look of this one? It's a doozy, it really is. Once again, I'm not doing it justice, Mark, am I? <laughs> yeah. Deary me. Oh, look, at least it's a pair. What looks like it could be a shortcut. Oh, someone shot me right on the backside. Ah, there you go, look. <laughs> terrible, terrible guys. But, um, yeah, moving on, guys. Let's go back onto that menu. Well, that was fantastic, wasn't it? Eh? As I said, covered it in more depth in a separate video, guys. It was brilliant. It was, um, I, I do believe, the, the top uh, racing games, or what have you, for the uh, Dreamcast. A uh, brilliant, brilliant game, Wacky Races. Right, let's have a look at another movie, shall we? Let's have a look what we've got left. Oh, we've got N uh, NHL. Oh, let's no, let's work. Let's watch Marvel vs. Capcom, guys. Who doesn't love that bloody game to death? Right, here we go. Again, the usual down the bottom. There we go. Move down. Brilliant. Here we go. Hopefully you get a nice long movie this time as well. Oh my god, it looks awesome still. Oh, so awesome. Look at that bloody big clown face. Wow. What a fantastic game this is. Oh, look at the graphics on it. Fantastic. Again, look a bit washed out on the old demo disc, but uh, yeah. The colours on this game pop. Absolutely pop when you play the actual, actual game. Isn't it awesome? Oh, just, just, just fabulous, guys, fabulous. Again, it just makes you want to play it. Right, back onto the menu again. Right, this time we're going to play. Ooh, yeah, Super Magnetic Neo. As I said, covered this before, it's a fantastic platformer. 
very very forgotten about hidden gem guys an absolute and utter hidden gem here we go the gubbins at the bottom again and we'll move down and in we go nice uh, little uh, movie at the beginning of this one leave that to play oh it's still based on a titles and development very long time ago that was wasn't it Fantastic Genki and Crave there. Brilliant. Right, we've just got to click in for the movie to start. There we go. Press that damn start button. He says, there we go. New game, absolutely. Oh, there's the evil baby boss. Fantastic little intro movie there, fantastic. Now I'll tell you what guys, for this platformer, there's a lot of elements here that you've got to get used to. Um, it looks like you're starting a Crash Bandicoot game, doesn't it, at the beginning here. But yeah, you move along here. Obviously you can uh, jump like that. But if you want to jump a bit higher, you can go like that and make yourself magnetic, like that. There we go, yeah, like that. You can also make yourself completely magnetic by doing that. Yeah. There we go, guys. So back on here. Get up there, you bugger. Get on there. Yeah. Bit more there. Brilliant. And watch out for them enemies, guys. One hit and you are dead. So watch out for these. You're probably better off. Oh, I just dropped down the bottom there. Look. Get back up there, you little bugger. That's it. Yeah, watch out for them guys. You're best off just avoiding them, basically. There we go. Wicked. I'm going to play this absolutely awful. But watch this, guys. You can uh, zoom across here. There we go, like that. Ah, uh, no, 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 no. I didn't do it in time. What a silly arse. Right, okay. Here we go again. I should ignore all that because you've seen it. There we go. If you don't fall down there, you can get straight across. Unlike I did. Yeah, up there again. Right, okay, so right. So you jump, go like that, and then you do it again. That's it, and it gets you right across. There we go. Brilliant. So yeah. Excellent bloody game. This is great. Really Avoid him again. Just go for it. Pick up all the treats on the way. They will come in handy. Right, you get up there. That's it, got it. Oh, yeah, swine. Let's do that again. Oh, come on, do it again. You bugger. No, not going to do it for me this time. Okay, then, bugger you then. Right. Let's go here. Oh yes, go, keep going, keep going, keep going, no! <laughs> yeah, well, oh, there's that bloody bridge. This bridge gets me every freaking time. But there's all these here you can get, but you don't want to be dying too quick. So, oh, and I fell straight in the bloody water again. Oh dear. Not good. And the vibration's going blinking crazy. 
And I think you can see, guys, this is one fantastic, fantastic game. And just keep doing that. Yeah, throw him. Like you can get them and then chuck them. Yeah. That's it. We're across. Excellent. So yes, guys, you can see this, this. This is just a bloody awesome game. It really is. I'm so hidden. A hidden gem. Extremely hidden gem. That nobody flipping talks about. It is a gorgeous game. Really, really gorgeous. But guys, after that, it's time to move on. Right. After that doozy, how can we follow that up, eh? With another movie. Right, guys, back in we are. Let's have a look what we've got left here. Obviously, we can still play Toy Commander. But first of all, we need a movie, don't we? Let's have a look. What we've got left here, so NHL2K. Yeah, I think that is the last movie, guys. Yeah. So, right, we're up to uh, this one then. All right, here we go then. Usual, I'll let you read that. Move down. And in we go. Let's see how long this one is and uh, if it shows plenty of gameplay. Again, guys, I do like a hockey game as long as it's done well. There has been some awesome titles. Even the Gizmondo had a fantastic ice hockey game. <laughs> Just beating the cack out of each other. I love that. Fantastic. What a brilliant movie again, guys. I tell you what, getting some quality movies this time. Nice and long. Showing plenty of gameplay. Right on to the last one and then we're diddly diddly done. So yeah, we'll move over to Toy Commander Playable. As I say, seen it many times before on these demo discs. Uh, let's hope they give us a different level. Right, in we go. There's the gubbins again. Let you read that. Move down. And in we go, guys. Let's see what it gives this time, eh? There's your, yeah, your title screen. And let's go in. Yep, one player. I don't suppose you can even do multiplayer, really, on this bit. Maybe you can. Who knows? Right, here we go. I'm on my Todd, so I won't be finding out. Right, it does look like we're getting a different bit, guys, so that'll be good. Okay. Loading, please wait. Yes, a different bit, guys. Look at this, round the pool. Wow, wicked. It looks like lots of Ken and Barbies and whatever there. Yep, good old Ken and Barbie. Right, so this time we have a lorry. So wicked, how do we move him? Come on in. Ah ha, shoulder buttons, guys, shoulder buttons. Right, so let's have a little drive around and look what we've got here. Wicked. Picking up some bits. So can we knock Ken and Barbie over? That's what I want to know. Can we knock them over? Let's have a look. No, that's all. Oh, that's not fair. Should have been able to knock them over. Well, that would have been fun, wouldn't it? I couldn't remember from <laughs> the actual uh, game as such. But yeah, fantastic. Oh, I, I really love this game, and it was a, you know, 
It's a very early release and uh, what a fantastic one. Look at that smelly shoe. <laughs> That's like my shoes from work. Yeah, smelly shoes. Who doesn't like a nice smelly shoe? Oh, if you go in the water, you blow up. There you go. Well, that's an example there for you. Now we're a plane. Wow, okay. Wicked. That's what I love about this game. You do die, you change into something else. And I suppose we're supposed to be shooting this sun thing here, are we? No, maybe not then. What are we supposed to be shooting then, guys? I can't remember. Oh, just that there. Yeah, there we go. Oh, fantastic, people. Fantastic. Shall we purposely crash him and see what we swap into? Go on then. Let's purposely crash him into the water. Come on. Bang. There we go. What are we going to change into now? Nothing. Mission failed. Oh, that's not fair. Oh, dear. Right. Where are they going to start us this time? Back with the truck, is it? Let's see, shall we? Could well be. The truck again. Obviously, we've seen all this already, but we'll go through it again. Good old Ken and Barbie. Yeah, it's the truck again, guys. So, yeah, that's pretty damn cool. At least in the demo, you get to use two vehicles. Let's try not to go straight into the water this time. Hooray, boost, look at that. Wow. Fanta oh, I wonder if you could have knocked Ken and Barbie over after getting the boost. I bet you can. Hmm. Bam, there's not one near them, is there? Ah, back into the water again. But that's okay, guys. Because, let's face it, we are going to have to bring this to an end. But we will do the old red baron here. That's what it looks like, isn't it? Again. So a little fly around again. You cannot shoot that sun. That's a shame. You can shoot that. We did already, didn't we, I think? Oh, we're supposed to be shooting that other aeroplane. There was another one flying around, I'm sure, just then. Was there? Not too sure. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it was an optical illusion. You can go up here. Wicked. Yeah, that is, that, that is just fabulous, guys, isn't it? Shoot the picture right on our ass. Yeah. And let's have a look down here. Oh, there's things, oh, look, things running around down here. Was it ants or something? There's a smelly shoe again. What are we doing here then? All right, let's have a look. There's something down there, definitely. Way crash. Right, well, that was a nice little look at it, guys, wasn't it? Let's go back into the water. Bang! Right. <laughs> Mission failed again, guys. Right. Back in a sec. I'll tell you what, guys. That was a fantastic volume. Wow. Bloody fantastic. Uh, yeah. One of the best ones again, guys. One of the best ones. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah, we go. We'll go over it again. Wacky Races. Playable. Oh, brilliant game. Super Magnetic Neo. Playable. Oh, what a hidden gem. Toy Commander. Playable. Awesome bloody early release title. Space Channel 5 movie. Oh my god, I am so going to have to cover that game. Dance game it may be, but a fantastic one it is. Then NHL 2K. Love an ice hockey game. Done well, and that is a very well done one. Virtua Tennis. Fantastic, fantastic bloody... Um, Franchise, I mean, every single one has been brilliant. Of course, that was a movie. And Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Movie, and oh my god, what a stunning title. So yes, guys, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Volume. Uh, obviously, we're going to get the uh, the roller, whichever one it might be this time. It does uh, switch around, I've realised now. You know, one minute you'll have Capcom vs. Marvel and all that, and then it'll be suddenly another one. Um, yeah, that is a fantastic volume. Um, oh, I mean, the Christmas edition still takes some beating, but this is a very, very close lick in the bum of the Christmas edition. Um, oh, just some fantastic playables there. What with Wacky Races and uh, oh, Neo and oh, yeah, absolutely gorgeous. You must have been over the sodding moon when you got this one. 
stuck on the front of your official Dreamcast magazine back in the day. You must have been absolutely stalked. So yes, guys, that's, that, that is already my final thoughts, guys, really. As we uh, go into the roller here, what are they doing this time? Oh, it's Space Channel 5 again. Right. Yeah, final thoughts, guys. Awesome edition. Awesome volume. Just makes me wonder now what volume 12 can bring and can it beat this one? I think this is going to be a very hard one to beat. Absolutely. Uh, look out for the uh, Space Channel 5 standalone video because that is definitely coming because that has really whetted my appetite because I love that sodding game. And I don't know what it is. Maybe I'm just a freak, but I find her quite sexy for a video game character anyway. Certainly sexier than Lara Croft, but there you go. Maybe I'm just a complete and utter geek. And an old one. Mm. But yes, guys, that was brilliant. I'm just going to say the usuals. If you're not subscribed already, please think about dropping me a sub. Give me a thumbs up. Comment below what you thought of this volume of Dream On, guys. I think it's awesome, but do you? And again, guys... Tap that bell icon and the all icon to get the notifications. And with that, I'm going to leave uh, Ula or Ula or whatever you want to bloody call her dancing away in her tiny skirt and her knickers. Right. That, guys, I'm going to say I'll be the same. Tschüss and goodbye, guys. And I'll see you in the next one.